Hey everyone, thanks for checking out another bonus episode of The New Marketing Show. Catching us on YouTube, Instagram, TV, all that great stuff. So, you know, a common theme that I'm hearing from a lot of my developer friends, a lot of my marketing friends are, you know, they're feeling extremely overwhelmed. And, you know, if you're a business owner or you're running a business, I can imagine, you know, you may be feeling the same thing too with everything opening, closing, reopening, closing again, you know, just an uncertain landscape of things. So. A couple things that I do <clears throat> when I feel like things are getting off the track, and believe me, I'm under the gun just like everybody else, is one, I slow down, I stop, I make a list, I prioritize, I see what's gonna, I, I, I know what's gonna move the needle the most in the least amount of time, and let's tackle that. From there, what else is the most important? What deadlines are realistic? What deadlines are unrealistic? How can we go ahead and make sure that we're hitting all of our realistic deadlines, communicating on what deadlines are unrealistic and setting them accordingly? The other thing is when I feel really, really stressed and really kind of anxious and out there, it's because something is unorganized in, in my world and especially in my dev world. So going through a project right now, I realize I do not have a lot of key components that I need to build out some functionality. That's a huge problem. So it's at that, the moment that you realize it's time to hit the pause button, contact everybody, sound the alarms, and make sure that you get what you need to set yourself up for success. Now, as a professional, I believe that it's our job to set our clients up for success. But conversely, it's also our job to keep our clients accountable so that we can achieve successes for them and make sure that they're giving us what we need to get things done. I find that if you go ahead and you take care of just these couple of things, my anxiety, or if I take care of these couple of things, my anxiety, my my uh, panic or, or whatever, kind of lessens. From there, you know, I try to clear my head, maybe meditation, exercise, make sure I'm eating well, make sure I'm sleeping, make sure I'm taking care of myself. And I find that when I'm fully rested, fully with my mind in the game and know what I need and have things prioritized and organized, things go a little bit smoother. So hang in there. I hope everybody's doing well and I'll talk to you soon.